Welcome to this brief instructional video on joining a Microsoft Teams meeting on the web. You can also join a Teams meeting with the Teams desktop application. In fact, joining with the Teams app will give you the most fully featured meeting experience, so if you have it installed, I recommend you join using the app. But if you are a guest or prefer not to install Teams on your computer, continue on with this video. You can join a Teams meeting on the web by clicking on a Join Microsoft Teams meeting link like the one you see here. It'll be in an email or a calendar appointment. You'll need either the Google Chrome or Microsoft Edge internet browsers to join. Click the link to open a Join Conversation page in your browser that gives you a few options for joining. If Teams is installed on your computer, your browser may ask you if you would like to open the app. Click Open Microsoft Teams to launch the meeting in Teams. If you'd rather join on the web, instead, click Cancel to dismiss this prompt. The Join Conversation page gives you the option to install the Teams app or join on the web instead. Either option works, but this video is focused on quickly getting you into a meeting without downloading software. If you're using an unsupported browser, the Join on the Web Instead button is replaced by a Join in Microsoft Edge button. Click Join on the Web Instead to continue. Look for a pop-up notification from your browser asking for permission to use your microphone and camera. Click Allow. Next, you are taken to the Audio and Video Settings page. Click these slider buttons to set whether you will enter the meeting with video on or off, and whether your microphone will be open or muted upon entry. Here, I am set to have my camera off and my microphone open upon joining. Click the settings wheel if you need to change which video and audio devices are used in the meeting. Next, type your name in the enter name field. It's best to use your first and last name so the meeting organizer will know who you are. Once your settings are configured and you're ready to join the meeting, click the Join Now button. You might be presented with the message, someone in the meeting should let you in soon. For security, some meetings require guests to wait in a lobby until they are admitted to the meeting by a presenter. The people in the meeting will be notified that you are waiting in the lobby, and if you are expected, someone will let you in. Once you're let into the meeting, you can control your options and access features by using the buttons on the Meetings Controls panel that appears when you mouse over the video window. The Camera button lets you turn on or off your camera. The Microphone button lets you mute your microphone or open it back up. Users with presentation permissions can share their screen with this Share button. Click this Chat Bubble button to open up the Text Chat panel. You can type your message in this text field and hit enter to send it. Click the Show Participants button to see a list of participants in the meeting. When the meeting is over, click the red hang up button to exit the meeting. Thank you for watching this instructional video. To learn more about the features of Microsoft Teams, please check out the related documents on the You Know It knowledge base. If you have any questions, please let us know by contacting the UW-Green Bay IT Help Desk.